Good evening. Hi, everybody. It's nice for you to join us again tonight. We hope you're well, and we hope you've been enjoying the devotions, and we hope you enjoyed Family Friday last week, and there'll be more of that this week. But we also wanted to share with you something fun that's starting tomorrow, and that is soul food. So check out the promo after the devotional, and uh, join us tomorrow at noon for a cooking demo. Um, it's just a fun thing for us to do together during this quarantine time. Please do make sure to watch out for that. And tonight, to begin with, uh, I would like to begin by singing a song of praise to our God. So do join us. It's a familiar song. And uh, I hope that you not only enjoy it, but really mean it from your hearts as we sing this song of praise to our God.
Amen. Our God deserves to be magnified. He is great. Alam niyo po, even if the situation that we are all in does not look or appear to be very great, our God deserves to be magnified and be glorified nonetheless. And uh, He deserves it. Um, God is not uh, dethroned from where He sits, from where He is, simply because of all that is going through. Mm -hmm. And these uh, circumstances that we are in can be very challenging, can be very difficult. In fact, it can be very dispiriting. Um, the longer this quarantine is taking, I am noticing in myself and in our families, in my family, that uh, we seem to struggle more and more as this quarantine is extended. Well, I think we have to work really hard mm -hmm. to keep our eyes on the Lord. And the more that it is extended, mm -hmm. the more that our faith is being stretched. Mm -hmm. Uh, the more that our character is being tested, mm -hmm. the way we deal with our kids, the way we relate to each other, our faith is being tested even more. Like, in the isip namin is like, in provisions, because you know, the longer it gets, the more that our provisions are becoming less and less, and then we also wonder about the future. But in, in regard to this, Tonight, I would like to just remind all of us that kapag mga ganitong situation that we are discouraged or where we see uh, ourselves uh, or finding ourselves uh, being in a place of difficulty or struggling with our faith, let us turn to Jesus. Let us go to Jesus. Sa kanya tayo lalapit. And this is what I would like for us to uh, be reminded of tonight. We actually sang a song last Sunday, or I sang a song last Sunday that talks about coming to Jesus. Mm -hmm. And uh, when we are thirsty, when we are afraid, when we are fearful, all that we need to do is turn to Jesus. You know, one thing that this quarantine has taught me and taught us is, you know, everything that we have been holding, holding on to, um, wala silang, they have no power to actually sustain us. Mm -hmm. And we are left with nothing but Jesus Christ alone. Which is everything. Which is everything. That's why we need to turn to Him. We need to come to Him. We need to call unto Him. And we would like to sing this song for you. So our kids are joining us tonight. Uh, so watch out. Watch out. <laughs> we hope that uh, this will uh, inspire you. That uh, indeed, sa mga panahon ngayon, there is no one that we could turn to, call unto, Accept our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So do join us as well as we turn, as we call unto Jesus Christ tonight. Bye.
sing with your kids, even as squirrely as they might be, or even unwilling as they might be, but do sing with your kids and praise the Lord together. <laughs> sing and declare the truth of the Lord over your family in these times. It is so, so important. So just go for it and do it and be together and give hugs and love and giggles and lots of affirmation and encouragement at this time. We love you, Faith Fellowship. God bless you. God bless you. We love Bye. you.